Thanks for joining me this afternoon as I introduce you to the new sermon series that we're starting at Keith Church this next Sunday. We're going to be talking about children's stories for the next few weeks. And I don't know about you, but I just love children's toys and being able to uh, once again uh, become a kid for just a few minutes. So the first story that we're going to be dealing with this first Sunday is the little engine that could. Now, I'm not going to read every word for word of this book to you, but I do want to remind you of the story that there was once a train filled with toys and good things for children that were trying to go up the mountain. And they broke down and needed help. They went to the first train, which was a shiny new engine. This engine said, oh, I'm much too shiny to be able and important to do what, what you need me to do. I just can't think about lowering my standards in order to help you over the mountain. They came to the next train which was a large locomotive. This locomotive was like, I'm much too important carrying uh, important passengers around to help you with your task. I'm sorry, I'm just too busy. They came to the next one, which was an old broken down train that was much too old and much too slow to be able to go over the mountain. He just said, I'm too tired. I just can't do it. And finally, a small little blue engine came along. And the blue engine says, I'm not very big, and I've never been over the mountain before. I've only been used for in the train yard, but I'm willing to give it a try. So the toys all got on the little engine, and they went faster and faster up the hill. The little engine said, I think I can, I think I can, I think I can. And guess what? He did. Because he believed in what he knew he could do, he was able to achieve something that was seem seemingly impossible. Friends, I hope you will join us in worship at either 9 or 11 on Sunday mornings at Keith Church as we discover the truth about children's books and the truth that God has for us in these stories. God bless.